Introduction Look at this bookshelf. There are six sections in the bookshelf. Ram's mother asked him to arrange 30 books in the shelf with each section containing equal number of books. Now how is Ram going to do the work? It is easy if Ram knew division. He has 30 books and 6 sections, so each section will have 5 books. Simple, isn't it? Do you want to learn how this is done? Let us together find this out. Objectives At the end of this lesson you'll be able to Divide numbers by subtraction Divide numbers by long division method Divide numbers by short division method Check your division Divide by grouping numbers Relate division with multiplication Equal sharing Here are six apples and three caterpillars. If they share apples equally, each caterpillar will get two apples. Six apples divided into three caterpillars are equal to two apples each. If there are six apples and two caterpillars, each caterpillar will get three apples. Six apples divided by two is equal to three apples each. Divide by subtraction. We will now learn division by subtraction. Let us divide 16 by 4. Subtract 4 from 16. We get 12. Now subtract 4 from 12. We get 8. Subtracting 4 from 8. We get 4. Similarly, subtract 4 from 4. We get 0. Remember to keep subtracting till we get 0. Let us now see how many 4s have been subtracted. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 4s have subtracted. So the answer is 4. That means 16 divided by 4 is 4. Long division. We will now divide 68 by 2 by long division method. For this, we write 68 divided by 2 as shown on screen. Look at the first number from left side in 68. It is 6. We start dividing from left side. First, we will divide 6 by 2. 6 divided by 2 is 3. So, we put that 3 right above the 6. Now, multiply the 3 and 2 and put the answer right under the 6. Now we do subtraction, that is, 6 minus 6 is equal to 0. We carry down the second number. Now we will divide 8 by 2. 8 divided by 2 is 4, so we put that 4 right above the 8. Multiply the 4 and the 2 and put the answer right under the 8. Do the subtraction, that is, 8 minus 8 is equal to 0. We ended with a 0 at the bottom. And the answer is 34. Here 68 is dividend. 2 is the divisor. 34 is the quotient. And remainder is 0. Long division with remainder. Let's now solve another division question. Divide 25 by 3. The first number from left in 25 is 2. Can we divide 2 by 3? No. 3 cannot be divided by 2. Therefore, we take both the numbers from 25. Now divide 25 by 3. We know 3 multiplied by 8 is 24. And 3 multiplied by 9 is 27. 27 is more than 25. So we will take 3 multiplied by 8, which is 24. So put 8 right above 25 and put answer below 25. Now subtract. 25 minus 24 is 1. We can see 3 cannot divide 25 as we get a remainder as 1. Here 25 is dividend, 3 is the divisor, 8 is the quotient and remainder is 1. Long division by two-digit number. 
Let us now learn to divide 948 by a two-digit number 21. The number 948 in the dividend and 21 is the divisor. 9 cannot be divided by 21. So look at the first two numbers from the left in the dividend. Divide 94 by 21. 21 fours are 84. Write 4 above 94 and 84 below 94. Subtract 84 from 94 and write answer below 84. Go to the next number in the dividend. The next number is 8. Now drag the number down. The number becomes 108. Now divide the new number 108 by 21. 21 fives is equal to 105. Place 5 above and the answer under 108. Subtract 105 from 108. Answer is 3. 21 cannot divide 3, so 3 is the remainder and 45 is the quotient. Short division method. Now we will divide 748 by 3 by short division method. Divide the first number in the dividend. 3 twos are 6 and 7 minus 6 is 1. Write 2 above and 1 near 4 to make it 14. Then divide 3 into 14. 3 fourths are 12. 14 minus 12 is 2. Write 4 above and write 2 in front of 8 to make it 28. Then divide 3 into 28. 3 nines are 27. 28 minus 27 is 1. Put your answer 1 as the remainder. Check your division. There should be a way to check your answer. Let us look into it now. You must remember that 15 divided by 3 is 5. Is this answer correct? Let us check it. Here divisor is 3, quotient is 5 and remainder is 0. To check the answer we need to multiply divisor and the quotient and then add the remainder to the answer. If the answer is equal to the dividend then our answer is correct. Here the answer is 15. And this is equal to the dividend, therefore the answer is correct. Division by grouping. I have 36 marble tiles. I can keep 4 marble tiles in one box. How many boxes do I need? 4 marbles in the first box. Here, 32 marble tiles are left. 4 marble tiles in the second box. Now, 28 marble tiles are left. 4 more marble tiles in the third box. Now, 24 marble tiles are left. Similarly, we keep on adding 4 marble tiles in each box. So, at last we have ninth box in which last 4 marble tiles are kept. 36 marble tiles have filled up 9 boxes. 36 marble tiles are put into equal groups of 4. Need 9 boxes. Relation between division and multiplication. Friends, 18 divided by 2 is 9. And if we multiply this 2 and 9, we get 18. 2 multiplied by 9 is 18. 16 divided by 2 is 8. And 2 multiplied by 8 is 16. Similarly, 25 divided by 5 is 5. And 5 multiplied by 5 is 25. Summary Let us summarize what we have learned. Division of numbers by subtraction method, long division method, Short division method. Dividend is equal to quotient into divisor plus remainder.